It's time for Chapter 7. There's only one place to go in this town if you need reliable intel. Uh, the web where all the secrets of Ijincho get caught. Komiju. Komiju? Yeah. If someone really is trying to fuck with the Ijin 3's balance of power, that someone being Mabuchi, as you claim. There's no way the Komi Jewel don't know about it. I like this guy's Information is what they trade in. It's practically their currency. Hmm. He's right. Eugene Cho's got lots of people willing to sell secrets. And if you follow each secret long enough, they all end up in Komi Jewel. Yeah. I don't know how they do it. But whatever their system, the info is always 100% accurate. It's incredible. Doesn't seem real. I'm not saying you have to use the Komi Jewel to find evidence of your Mabuchi theory. If you got other ideas, fine. Just prove to me that Mabuchi killed your boss. I'll let the captain here live until you return. Hmm. By the way, don't even think about running. If so much as your pinky toe crosses the Ichincho border, the captain dies. And I still wouldn't be satisfied. So your friends and your family would be next. Wait, what the hell's with that? Don't argue, Sachan. These guys don't do logic or compassion. Honestly, I want an answer just as bad as you all do. If Mabuchi really has betrayed me, then my gang's gonna be split down the middle. Neither the Seiryu clan nor the Komi Jewel is gonna be thrilled about that. But that's why I need contingency plans. You see now? All the shit I gotta deal with. Man, I sure hope Mabuchi's innocent. But of course, then I have to kill you all. <laughs> Painfully. No complaints, I hope. <laughs> no need to be all giddy about it. Well, what are you waiting for? Go find proof that Mabuchi killed your soap landowner. Kasuga. I don't think we have a choice. I know. You're probably aware, but the Komi Jewel don't fuck around. So be careful. Finding the evidence won't do any good if you're dead. You almost sound like you care. Kasago, we really gotta get moving. And fast. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yo. <laughs> I feel like that was the understatement of the century. That's the best I can do, I'm afraid. You'll have to figure out the rest for yourselves. Right.
Ah, cool. Nice. Have to do some grinding offline. through this area before I want to come back this way and see if I can find a cat or what I actually think is up here is a statue thing ooh I need to go check on all the stuff I was growing don't mind me just, you know Picking up food off the floor. Whoops. Oops. I'll mess around in here later. Um, um, this way. Um, um, all right. Did I see a shiny? over here? No, I didn't. Just the lights glinting off things. Alright. So anyways. Um. Ooh. Quests. So many quests. Floor, maybe? This guy's awful. Yo. Ah. Okay, I'll kick his ass. Yeah, I've dropped by the Suji Dex guy a couple of times. He actually called me and was like, hey, you haven't come and seen me.
Got it. Okay, all done. Man, that was so good. <laughs> Hope you tasted some of it. You scarf that down real quick. Yeah. Somehow I always eat faster when there's company. Right. You mentioned something about always eating alone. Mm-hmm. Usually it's just me and my mom. But lately she just leaves me money for dinner and goes off somewhere. She ever tell you where she's going? Nope. Huh. Anyway, thanks for staying with me. You got a little man. Hope I helped you kill at least a little time. Yeah, it was fun. I wish we could eat together all the time. Uh, sorry. That was just me being selfish. Forget I said that. So, you come eat here a lot? Yeah. Back when Dad was around, it would always be us three. But now it's just me by myself. Gotcha. Then why don't we come back here again? Better to eat with a buddy, right? You mean it? All right. Great. But for now, you're going home. Okay. Then see you next time. Oh, I missed one. Guess I'll just have to paddle him. Yeah, I mean, for boss fights, Ares kind of meh. Um, but for clearing out random mobs, she's amazing. Over. Oh dear, that wasn't enough time. Huh? 
Excuse me. You need help crossing the street? Well, of sorts. Yes. Looks to me like the signal changes pretty quick. Why don't I just carry you over? No. And while I do appreciate your kindness, that won't be necessary. Are you sure you're gonna be okay like that? I'll be fine. You see, I made the decision to walk with my own two feet until I'm dead and gone. Heck, I won't even get in a car unless I have to. Well, at least you're sticking to your guns. Yes, and that's why I intend to cross this street without any assistance. <laughs> Okay, then if that's the case, go, oh, it's green. All right, Umeko, you can do this. Here we go. Uh. Oh, dear. How many times has it been now? Why don't you go to a different crosswalk? Maybe without a signal. If I did, that means that's a victory for this here crosswalk. And I can't let it win. Oh, I do wish these old legs of mine were quicker. Hmm. You know, I'd like to help, but I'm fresh out of ideas. <laughs> oh, don't you worry about me, son. I just think I'll head home for the day. Oh. Hmm. Well, that's no fun. Alright, so I'm guessing that's the old lady, and that's the boy that wants to eat again. Over here is something. Lots of properties on sale here. They even got a four-bedroom with a living room, kitchen, dining room, and a yard. I'd love to live in a place like that someday. Yeah? I don't know. Sounds a little too big for me. Huh? Prison got you to like small spaces, is that it? Shut up, man. Think about it. You got your place now with the futon, toothbrush, and a cup of noodles all within reach. Or some big old house with all that shit separated by five rooms or something. Which sounds better? I'm... I'm... The house? Yeah, I guess you're... I don't know. I, I mean, I see where Ichiban is going with this. By the way, I love the uh, Seagull Cinema mini game with the sheep. It is way too much fun. Ah, uh, this must be a part time hero. Hey, Yumiko san! Isn't it time you moved on to something more appropriate for your age? I. I really don't know what you're suggesting, Shio chan. Why are they ganging up on that dominatrix lady? Don't you think you're oh past your prime? Vampire. Look, nobody wants you around. So listen to the number one girl and leave. But I, I do still have clients who request me. So for their sake, I can't just... Yeah, yeah, we know you're totally lying. The rep of this place has been dropping lower than that sagging ass of yours. <laughs> My advice? Find a cushy day job and let the next generation run the show. Got it, granny panties? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
But really, don't you think it's time to put down the whip? You could break a hip in those heels. No! I take pride in what I do. I've always done my best to help my clients leave happy, even if there aren't many left. I wasn't asking for your opinion. I'm saying you're nothing but an eyesore. Understand? <sighs> What's with that look? You want me to slap it off your face? <gasps> All right, ladies, that's enough. Huh? I know it's none of my business, but you're taking this way too far. <laughs> oh, and frankly speaking, I think you're the ones bringing your club down, not her. Uh, what? Ew, what is with him? He one of yours, Yumiko-san? Only a loser would eavesdrop. This loser's only here because he heard you stirring up trouble. Half the town could, really. I was just passing by. Then why don't you mind your own business? We don't have to listen to some random nobody. Forget it, girls. Let's just go. Hold on, Shiho. We're not finished with her. Yeah? Well, I am. Besides, I got an even better idea. Watch your back out there, Grams. Yeesh. You all right there? I am. Thank you. Yes, there's always haters no matter where you go. Sometimes life's a harsh mistress. All right, uh, let's go follow up on that. Um, why is my computer running low on battery? Uh, the cat's pulled. That's better. Oh. You could have still no すみませんでした。すみませんでした。Hey. Hmm? Fetch a fetish. The Dom Dome. Well, now I guess I need to put together Mr. Masochist and a uh, Granny S and M. All right, let's check out this down here since we're in the neighborhood. <laughs> Thank you. 
Um. <laughs> Get me out of here. Where'd that come from? Somebody help. What the heck happened to him? All right. Just ignore what I see. Let's help the guy. Help me! Someone! Anyone! Hey, you all right? You hold still. I'll get you out right now. <sighs> Thought I was gonna die. Man, you really saved my hide. I owe you one. What were you doing in there, though? How does anyone even end up like that? Nothing shady, I can tell you that. I'm just a humble vagabond. People call me Shige-san, and that there's my treasure trove. What, this dumping ground? Yeah. I don't want to say it too loud, but this mountain of trash here is a gold mine. Eh, well, <laughs> uh, sometimes I get stuck trying to dig out the good stuff. You really dig through this crap? Bet you there's not even fool's gold in there. Sure. Maybe it seems like junk on the surface, but dig deeper, and you'll come up on the good stuff. Take this doohickey, for instance. Whoa, nice watch. I would hope so. It's worth a million yen. You serious? Why would somebody throw that away? What even is this place? Seems to me it's where the Yakuza get rid of whatever they need, well, disposed of. So, I poke around here long enough, I figure I'll end up with a small fortune. <laughs> Whoa, slow down. Aren't you being kind of reckless? If you get caught, it's over for you. Oh, ain't nobody caught on yet. Besides, they're throwing away stuff they don't even want. How can they complain? Try saying that to their face. Come on. Aren't you even the least bit interested? You never know. You might find something right for you. Yeah, I don't think so. You sure? Nobody even wants this stuff. So no point in passing it all up. Anyway, why don't I give you what I found today as thanks for bailing me out? Oh, I should probably get your name first, shouldn't I? It's Kasuga. Okay then, Kasuga-san. Today, I'm bringing in the mother load. Is he gonna be all right? I better come back and check up on him at some point. Oh boy. This is gonna get weird in a hurry. All right, I... Oh yeah, there's the dungeon entrance. I... Um. Hmm? Oh, 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 for the old lady. Oh. Uh. Hmm? 
Come back, Ichiban! You bastard! So <sighs> hmm? God find the old lady. Craving Kim Kimchi. Oh man, so many games, so little time is like, uh, there's a whole mood. I have actually been playing considerably fewer games than I normally do this month because I've been tied up in doing a lot of crafting. You call that a drink? Give me a double shot this time. Sir, haven't you had enough? I think you should call it a day. I thought it was the bartender's job to give people their drinks. You're being unreasonable, sir. I'm only concerned for your health. You should at least have a sip of water. So you're cutting me off? Way to make a man feel unwanted. Sir, can you please calm down? You're causing a scene right now. Yo, mind if I step in? Huh? Buddy, just take the water and chill. You'll feel a lot better. You know what? You all are a bunch of buzzkills. I'm taking my business elsewhere. What the heck was his deal? He's 
Not a regular, is he? He sort of is. It was actually Il Yu Jin, a former Korean megastar. You didn't recognize him? Nah, unfortunately, I can't begin to keep up with that stuff. Pretty crazy to run into somebody famous here of all places, though. That's a first for me. Well, he's retired from the industry now. Got caught up in a scandal. He always had such a clean image, too. But I guess fame changes people. Today wasn't even the worst I've seen him. Hope he's not causing trouble somewhere else. The former star, huh? <laughs> Who's hungry? Me. Oh, this must be the masochist. Hey, dude! Have you lost it? Just leave me alone. Wait, don't I know you? The guy from the red light district. Uh... Masochist, right? So you've heard of me before. Mostly just rumors from a fetish club. Anyway, I'm Kasuga. Kasuga-san, is it? I'm Soda Makinohara. Most people simply call me Mr. Masochist. Uh-huh. So why were you headbutting a tree just now? Because I want to feel. I want to hurt. Oh, right. I heard something like that from the club owner. About how you can't feel pain anymore? That would be correct. As a true glutton for punishment, I've spent many a night getting beaten half to death by beautiful women in leather, might I add. But that's beside the point. As the months turned into years, my senses began to dull. Eventually, I felt nothing. Happiness is fleeting, as they say. Dang. I know I started the conversation and all, but I can't relate to that. Like, at all. Here's who I really am. A man with a body unyielding, lusting for pain, yet never receiving. At least I built up muscle. They'd leave me twisted like a pretzel overnight sometimes. <laughs> Alas, I suppose this is no laughing matter. You're telling me. Which brings us to the tree. I thought it would hurt if I smashed it with my head. And did it? No. I felt stronger pain from a mosquito's embrace. Wow. It sounds like you've been through a lot, man. I don't know what to say. Much as I'd like to help, I should probably get going. Wait. Why don't you just hear me out? I noticed that you have a pretty solid physique, though it pales in comparison to mine. Uh, okay. Uh, preference for whip ladies aside, I wish to test my endurance out on you. 
Beggars can't be choosers, as they say. So let me ask you, Kasuga-san. Will you strike me with everything you have? You want me to hit you? Yes. If it hurts, there's still hope. Use whatever oh, tools you goodness. have. Oh, goodness. Gang up on me if you have to. You asked for it. And trust me, we ain't no mosquitoes. All right. Then come at me! He's very excited about this. What? Are you kidding me? See if this ought to do it. Kinda worried it won't though. Nancy Chan. That's enough. Victory. Well, I guess I got a Suji tax at least. Sumimasen. For real? It's kind of weird to feel bad for a masochist, but I kind of do. No, I want to go with 
this way. Does he burn to death? He does. The enemy is defeated. Alright. What else can I do? With finesse. Aw oh, yeah. <gasps> dirty iron. I need so much dirty iron for upgrades. Actually makes me happy to get it. Um, all right, straight north. Crossing against traffic. I'm totally gonna get run over. Yo. up Wow Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. This is a bad idea. Hey. Wakatta.
Okay. That's a cute ending. I'm still really craving kimchi now. Mm. some friends on the way. Excuse me, lady. Coming through. Bring it on. got run over. Hey, a Toho clan crest. Hello. What's going on here? Um. Excuse me. Could I ask you for a donation? Sorry, I'm kind of in a hurry. Oh. Sure. Wow. Thanks. Here. Really? Thank you very much. <laughs> it's nice to finally receive a donation. I saw you earlier. But it doesn't look like things are going too well. Yeah, it's true. No matter how hard I try, everybody just keeps walking past me. You're doing this all by yourself? Where are your parents? They've been working late to save up for the surgery. I got you. It must be tough. That's why I have to work just as hard as them. Besides... Please donate to children who are less fortunate. Donations, please. Here you go. Thank you very much. Those two are gathering money for children they've never even met before. I think that's amazing. It makes me want to try even harder. Sure. You're a good kid. Why don't we try this somewhere else? Huh? You won't get anywhere calling out to random strangers. You gotta draw some attention. Here, I'll help you out a bit. Oh, thank you so much! 
My name is Megumi. What about you, mister? I'm Kasuga. Okay, let's see if there's a better spot. Might help us draw in some donations. Let's try by that shop over there. Oh, okay. Motto. Sorry. Anna. Hey. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> hmm? Hmm. He wants the golden beetle, her golden dragonfly. I don't have one of those yet. <laughs> That's cute. Ted's just around the corner. Mm. 
No way. Maybe I should just get it for him. I see. Sure thing. They're going to steal her money, aren't they? I see what's going on. Like running back and forth between the two sub-stories. <laughs> I think I just casually broke the floor window there.
<laughs> All right. Time to kick their crazy butts. Let's go. Right. You want to fight? <laughs> Let's <see>. Okay. <laughs> Economic insoles. Yo. Good, you should feel terrible. I've learned many important life lessons from Yakuza. Like the best way to deal with street bugs is to throw thumbtack at them. Part-time hero quest completed. Um. Hey, Megumi. Everything cool? Oh, Hatsuka-san. You know, I haven't seen the usual donation people around here in a while. Huh. Hey, little girl. You got a second? It's you two! Uh. Keep up the good work for your brother. Bye! Well, that's all I have to say. I did see ya. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. This is for all your help. Oh, cute. Are you sure? Thanks. <laughs> Working hard as ever, I see. Can I make a donation? Yes, of course. Thank you very much. Well, I'm gonna get going. Keep it up. I will. Donations, huh? Never really gave it much thought. I should give more the next time someone needs help. Then again, I should also be careful of not getting scammed. All right. Uh, let's see here. Wow, nice.
to up the healing on you. Alright. Oh. I should probably save since I haven't in a while. Where to next? Looks like his stuff hasn't popped back up. Ooh, what's over here? Uh, wrong way. Looks like I already tried to. wasn't steamed before, he definitely is now. Alright, so in the corner. Oh, is this a cap I haven't tagged? It is. Cool. That's okay. And I'm going the wrong way. Excuse me, excuse me, coming through. Yeah. すみませんでした. Kasuga-san, is it? I'm Soda Makinohara. But most people simply call me Mr. Ma ah! hmm? oh. That's a funny coincidence. I do have some part-time hero work to report. Slowly working my way up. Sneaks. Mm. Oh. Yeah. 
Okay. Ooh. Ooh, that sounds painful. Oh, Ichiban, what have you done? Just need Lady BDSM to come and beat him up, apparently. What's going on? Who are you people? Oh, so this babe's Yumiko-chan, huh? Huh. She does look a bit on the older side, but <laughs> nothing a little lighting can't fix. <laughs> if anything, I like my ladies mature. Can't get enough of those milfs, huh? <laughs> what is this? Remember how we talked about sales? I thought I'd find you a little side job. Help make ends meet. Aren't I the sweetest? Shio chan why? Don't sweat the details. Now, this might get a little bit freaky, but isn't that your specialty? <laughs> Don't do this! I know that voice. Yumiko-chan. Damn. Where is she? Put the fuck down. Dude, roll the camera. We can edit this shit out later. Quit squirming. You don't want me cutting more than your clothes, do you? Stop! Crap. He's gonna do it. Hey, in comes Mr. Masochist. Ooh, called it. What in the fuck? Oh, I think it's... I could be hit by a truck buck naked and still wouldn't feel a thing. Who's this dirty old creep? I say, Mr. Masochist! Kasugasa? Oh, great. Another one. Look, we're filming something important here, so why don't you go piss off? Oh, am I in it? My agent never told me about this. Who wants to see your scroungy looking ass? What? You plan on sticking around? Then we'll stick you to the side of the pavement! Damn straight! Oh yeah, they're going down. I got this. Yeah, that's probably this. This hurts. I got this. Yeah. 
I love her bicycle kicks. Okay. How did you miss? Hey, who cares? How's it going? Ooh, there was a piece of armor in there. Shit! A top! Uh, get up! What's wrong with you guys? Hey! <gasps> Take these scumbags and get lost. What you did to Yumiko was way beyond sick. And don't let there be a next time. Yes, sir! Sorry for the trouble! <laughs> you hurt? No, I'm fine. Thanks again for being there. Oh, and you too. You have no idea how grateful I am. Don't be. I'm not that important anyway. I'm pretty much a dead man walking. Numb to pleasure. Numb to pain. Oh. For a guy like me, there's only one way out. Come on, you don't mean that. Normally I charge an arm and a leg for a slap like that. But you needed some sense knocked into you. You saved me from the worst nightmare I've ever experienced. I was scared out of my mind. Yet the first thing out of your mouth is how unimportant and worthless you are. That's not only disrespectful to me, but you disrespect yourself when you say things like that. It's a match made in heaven. They're going to be so happy together. That, that hurt. That's... Things. Hmm? Anyway, I wanted to return the favor for helping me out not only once, but twice. I know it's not much, but I hope you like it anyway. Oh! As for you, let me say thank you again. Sorry I had to hit you. But what can I give you? If I may. Would asking for another smack be too much? Huh? When you hit me just now, I was stunned. I haven't felt that kind of pain in ages. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I go too far? The opposite! I don't mean to freak you out, but I love being stepped on, spit on, crushed, maimed, you name it. But lately, I haven't been able to feel things, whether you tie me up or beat me down. That all changed with you. Never have I felt such burning admonition in my life. What you did was tenderize my heart. So please, I'm begging you. Tenderize my flesh once more. With this! You know I won't hold back. Wouldn't want you to, ma'am. Now execute me. Like you mean it, baby! Oh, oh gee! Oh, it hurts so good! <laughs> You're a naughty little boy. I'm at a loss for words. I've never been lacerated so lovingly before. Perhaps this is being too forward. Could you flog me senseless like this from now until the end of time? I promise I'll make you satisfied. We could live strappily ever after together. <laughs> yeah, too far, dude. Oh, <laughs> that's quite a tempting offer. A man who loves pain and a woman who lives to give it. You can't put a label on romance, I guess. Huh. Wonder what they named their kid. Uh, that quest was rewarding in unexpected ways. <laughs> yes, a pound made even better. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm dying.
I have multiple people on Telegram who are messaging me going, what did I just watch? Maybe I shouldn't be watching your stream while I'm at work. to play around in here but not on stream all right uh oh <gasps> oh oh i know this game this is the card game oh hang on no 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 hang on i got i gotta play this koi koi Let's just start it easy for now. Let's see how crazy the AI is on this. All right. Go easy on me, huh? got three ribbons already. I think I'll stick. Koi koi! Lots of ribbons on the table. Junk? Bleh. That's junk. Koi koi! Oh 
no. Junk. No, I'll take it. No hard feelings, <gasps> right? <gasps> oh, moon's on the table. Yeah, I gotta snag that. Ooh, and a ribbon. to Court. bird or whatever. Really close to ribbons, too. Ah. Yes! Junk. I'll take it. Hell yeah! Go easy on me, huh? I played a lot of this last year when Josh sent me the Sakura Wars game, and I got so addicted to it. Oh, I cleared off my mountain that I wanted. All right, well, let's start building some ribbons and seasons. Ah, stop taking all the ribbons! Gathering junk like it's going out of style. Cherry blossom viewing. Cool. Koi koi. Koi. My son. Yes. Variety. That's a lot of points for me. I think I'm good with 22 points. Hell yeah. Oh, there's a Sakura <gasps> and a moon. All right. Uh, moon's just too powerful. I have to take it first. Both. Yes! I'm gonna koi koi that. Koi! Ooh, I need to get the boar off the table. Ooh, two ribbons? Oh, it's another ribbon for me. Ooh, poetry ribbon. Oh, I, yeah, I think I'll stop there. Thank you. No um, hard feelings, right? Koi Koi is about memorizing the priority of cards that you want to take. Um, it's not hard, but it is involved. Oh, I can't take that moon, so I'll have to take the view. Start pulling down ribbons, maybe? Take all the red ribbons. Ah, he got a red ribbon. Ooh. Um, 
cross my fingers he doesn't immediately use that card because then I can get a soccer reviewing. Cherry blossom viewing. Um, you know what? I just I don't think I'm gonna be able to get better than that. Booyah! One more time. Okay, let's go. <gasps> oh wow, a moon and a rain. Um, and I don't have the cards to grab. Damn it. Um, and I don't have the cards to grab rain either. Shoot. Maybe start building rhythm ribbons. Ribbon I wanted, damn it. No, oh, well, that helps. <sighs> That's not gonna get me. Oh, 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 I want that. But I don't have a card to claim it with. Shoot. Man, he's building junk in a hurry. Oh, that's my ribbon. Yeah, I will take three lights. I will not koi koi that. No hard feelings, mm, right? In the rain, already on his side. There's no point. <gasps> I'll take that. Thank you. All right. I have a blue ribbon. There's a blue ribbon on the table. There's a light on the table. Oh, hey, rain. Ah, can I get four lights? in a hurry. And I can't match either of mine. Crap! This might go to him. Yeah, I'm gonna lose this hand. Just junk. Well, I guess I'll just take junk. Hell yeah! <gasps> I was lucky there. Ooh, Sakura's on the table. I can get it. Butterfly in my hand. Ooh, I'm grabbing all the ribbons now. Mm. I have not seen the deer yet. Ooh, but I'll take a light. Ugh. Damn it. <gasps> Rain Man. Ah. Yes, you took it. Ah! I am gonna lose. Back to actually playing the game. Um, so I made a few points. Let's see what kind of prizes there is. Ooh, silver insects. Oh. Interesting. Ooh. 
That's nice. That was like... That was the problem that I was having with him, is I didn't have a good weapon for him. Alright, if I need some insects, now I know where to come and get them. Uh, hostess, I guess. And that's her. Alright. How do I get out of here? Sweet! Alright. I was doing something. Yeah, I was going over here. The drunk idol. Go. Huh? Go. See you, Mr.
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. Oh. <laughs> ah, a little too much booze. More work for the kimchi! Then I became a god. <laughs> okay.
いらっしゃいませ。ありがとうございましたありがとうございます。いいえ。じゃあね。はい。ええ。それでは。OK。
Try to go to Isekai Road. Ooh, mysterious stone. That's definitely going to be used in crafting. That is a guy who's about to throw open his trench coat. by the cab. game is the best. Weaponologist? That might be a new Sujimon. Two Suji decks. I did it! Oot, finally catching up with an experience. Alright, I wanted to go. Go. Oh. Oh. Hey. Right. 
<laughs> Yo. Fifty million yen. Hey. <laughs> hey. You took pictures of me beating the crap out of him, and suddenly you think you can turn around and... Eat the crap out of me? I mean, I feel like there's just a flaw in the logic here, my friend. Especially since you went down faster than he did, so... But I'll take the Zuji decks. You fraud. I can't believe you decked your producer over a bad contract. A contract? Yeah. To my understanding, he wanted more money, so he went and socked the guy. There was a time that this was all the news talked about. No. The only reason he did that was to get his manager out of a jam. Wait. What's this about his manager? That producer he seemed to love so much actually tried to force himself on Il Yujin's manager. So in the heat of the moment, he did what he could to protect her. And to make sure she wasn't dragged into the spotlight, Il Yujin kept quiet. That's why... That's enough, Kasuga-san. Only the people involved need to know. Yeah, but... Wait, if your manager was a lady... Actually, I do know that producer had a terrible rep as a womanizer. And come to think of it, the whole fighting over money spiel was penned directly by him. Could that mean... You really did all that for your manager's sake? You've kept it a secret all this time, even at the cost of your career? Suzuki-san, I will tell you this only once. Do not speak of this to anyone. I'm not gonna let some media clown track down my manager and ruin her life again. If something like that does happen, you will be the one who pays. <clears throat> you look at me like that, I can tell you're not bullshitting. You protected her all right. Looks like I'm the fraud here. Instead of doing proper research, I only swallowed up the hype. Some journalist I am. All right, I deleted the pictures. Not a single one remains. Good. Kasuga-san, you really helped me turn my life around. Thank you. What can I say? You're a star with staying power. Keep your chin up, guy. <laughs> I certainly will try. But I do have the weight of what I've done hanging over my shoulders. Neither the media nor Suzuki-san had it wrong. I hit one man and caused others grief. My first order of business is to own up to what I've done. Make things right. Only then can I aim to be how I once was. An actor who touched people's hearts. <sighs> Well, if that lady at the park is anyone to go by, I'd say you're off to a great start. <laughs> Maybe so. Here, why don't you have this? My way of saying thanks. Well, I guess it's so long for now. See ya. Was that just now? Oh, nothing to worry about. I took a picture of Yusama's first step forward. Been a while since I posted about an actor not screwing up his life. Who knew it felt so good to support someone? So rather than yet another scandal, how about I cook up something a little more uplifting? Oh? An actor's road to redemption. Il Yujin announces spectacular return to showbiz. Well, how's that sound? Sounds good. Not bad at all. One of these days, I'll get him to give me an interview. Not about his past, but what he plans for the future. After seeing how different he is, 
Even the most jaded critic would give him another chance. Got that right. Guess I'll leave the journalism to you then. Ah. Should have got me his autograph. <laughs> All right, I, I think that's the perfect note to end the day on.